What if the Earth stopped spinning for just five seconds? It would wipe out everything instantly. This isn't science fiction, it's physics, and the consequences would be apocalyptic. Right now, as you're watching this video, you're moving at roughly 1,000 miles per hour. Don't believe me? The Earth rotates once every 24 hours, and at the equator, that translates to about 1,000 miles per hour. The closer you get to the poles, the slower you move. But even in New York or Madrid, you're still zooming at about 700 miles per hour. You don't feel this motion because everything around you, buildings, trees, the atmosphere, is moving at the same speed. But what if it all suddenly stopped? The laws of physics tell us that objects in motion stay in motion unless acted upon by an external force. If Earth's rotation halted for just five seconds, everything not firmly attached to the planet's bedrock would continue moving eastward at hundreds of miles per hour. Imagine you're driving at 70 miles per hour and slam into a concrete wall. Now multiply that impact by 10 or 15 times. That's what would happen to every single person, animal, vehicle, and building on Earth simultaneously. The momentum would instantly transform everything into deadly projectiles. Cities would be obliterated in seconds. Skyscrapers would topple like dominoes. Cars, people, and debris would become supersonic missiles traveling east. The air itself would keep moving, creating winds that would make the strongest hurricanes look like gentle breezes. Think about it. Air moving at 1,000 miles per hour is twice as fast as the most powerful tornado ever recorded. The oceans, which contain 332.5 million cubic miles of water, would continue their eastward motion, creating mega tsunamis hundreds of feet high. These walls of water would crash into coastlines with unimaginable force, penetrating miles inland and drowning entire regions in minutes. The Pacific Ocean would literally empty onto the west coasts of the Americas, while the Atlantic would drown Europe and Africa's western shores. But the catastrophe wouldn't end there. The sudden stop would create unprecedented seismic activity. The Earth's crust, usually floating on the semi-liquid mantle beneath it, would experience extreme stress as the mantle continued to rotate. This would trigger thousands of massive earthquakes simultaneously, many exceeding magnitude 9.0 on the Richter scale. The planet's tectonic plates would fracture in new places, causing volcanic eruptions across the globe. The atmosphere would be torn apart by the differential motion as it rushed eastward at supersonic speeds. It would create a global pressure wave that would rupture eardrums and collapse lungs. The friction between the moving air and the suddenly stationary surface would generate extreme heat, igniting wildfires that would spread across continents. And what about our technological infrastructure? All satellites would instantly be thrown out of their carefully calculated orbits. GPS navigation, global communications, weather forecasting, all gone in an instant. Power grids worldwide would collapse. The internet would vanish. In our interconnected world, this alone would bring civilization to its knees. After those five seconds, when the Earth resumed spinning, the chaos wouldn't end. The planet would essentially have to drag everything back into synchronized motion. Anything that survived the initial catastrophe would face a second wave of destruction as the surface accelerated back to 1,000 miles per hour. The oceans would slosh back in the opposite direction, creating another series of mega tsunamis. The atmosphere would be pulled along, creating reverse winds of similar intensity. The dust and debris thrown into the atmosphere would block sunlight for months or even years, triggering a nuclear winter-like scenario. Global temperatures would plummet. Crops would fail. The few human survivors would face starvation, disease, and a battle for the most basic resources. In essence, a mere five-second pause in Earth's rotation would reset civilization. It would be an extinction-level event comparable to the asteroid impact that wiped out the dinosaurs 65 million years ago. Fortunately, there's no known force in the universe that could stop Earth's rotation so suddenly. The planet has been spinning for 4.5 billion years, gradually slowing down due to tidal interactions with the moon. This natural deceleration is happening at a rate of about 1.7 milliseconds per century, imperceptibly slow. So while this scenario makes for a terrifying thought experiment, it's physically impossible. 
Earth's rotation is one of the most stable and reliable processes in our solar system. It's a fundamental rhythm that has allowed life to evolve and thrive on this planet for billions of years. And for that, we should all be grateful. Next time you feel the ground solid beneath your feet, remember, you're actually hurtling through space on a massive spinning rock. And thank the laws of physics that this spin never ever stops. Subscribe to increase your knowledge through videos like this.